this is the most depressing place that I have ever been into. It's just unbelievable. The amount of suffering that you can feel while looking at those thousands and thousands of shoes. So I'm in the city of Lublin today and I'm going to take part in my favorite TV game show. I'm just a little bit nervous. <laughs> it's over. Let's see the local cemetery here. This is the oldest cemetery in Lublin and it shows we have a lot of old monuments which are really cool a lot of angels and stuff like that so some of the people are saying that I should use a backhoe to dig a grave well good luck with that here this is how a typical Polish cemetery looks like I mean, it's very densely packed, as you can see. I have no idea what's up with this one. It's, it's in some kind of a cage. Hmm. That's weird. Here's a crypt that you can go into. Here's the door. Okay, since I'm here, I would like to see Maidanek concentration camp. Let's go.
so as usual I have 20 minutes to the train and I'm far away from the station so let's put it in the second gear Yeah. Oh, it's the first time in my life that I hope that the train is late. Oh. Oh. And there goes my train. Now, thanks to my stupidity, I need to wait here in this middle of nowhere for four hours for the next train. So instead of sleeping comfortably for six hours, my trip has elongated itself to 15 hours of waiting and sitting upright. Here's the map of the place. It's a kind of a 3D map. So I have four hours in here. It's a bit cold, but I can manage. What an idiot. So I was late because I was looking for the worst fridge magnet with Lublin that I can get. So let's see it. There it is. I will sit here for four hours and then wait for five hours on the next station for the train home. Let's try to find the bright side because otherwise depression. Okay, 10 minutes has passed. Two more hours to go. This is really old school. Look at this. <laughs> Stones. So I'm in Warsaw and I have like three hours of waiting and then six hours in the last train. Yeah, now straight to bed. Yeah. 